Following the Enforcement Directorate's raids on three locations linked to activist Harsh Mandar, over 600 people, including academics, journalists, filmmakers, activists and lawyers, have come out in his support. In a joint statement, they have said the Constitution of India and law of the land shall prevail, exposing these intimidatory tactics exactly for what they are, an abuse of state institutions to try and curtail all our rights. The signatories include historian Raj Mohan Gandhi, advocates Prashant Bhushan and Indra Jai Singh, activist Medha Park, economist Jean Drez and they have said in the statement that Mr. Mandar and the Center for Equity Studies that he heads has been subjected to continued harassment by multiple state agencies over the past year. The enforcement directed on Thursday conducted searches on the premises linked to the former IS officer and social activist in connection with an alleged money laundering probe. In fact, the state says Constitution of India and the law of the land shall prevail, exposing these intimidatory tactics for what they are, an abuse of state institutions to try and curtail all our rights. The current rates by the ED and IT departments are to be viewed in this context as part of the continuing chain of abuse of state institutions to threaten, intimidate and try and silence every critic of the present government.